Hi, and welcome to this video on how to access Sleep Journal through the Oregon Tech Library. Here is the library homepage, www.oit.edu. For those of you in Blackboard, on the left hand side you can see a Research Services or Research Assistance button. If you click there, one of the links goes to the library homepage. The blue arrow points to where you can enter the term sleep and then hit. You will be prompted to log in. This is the same information as you use for MyOIT, Blackboard, and everything else, Oregon Tech. If you've already logged on to my or to MyOIT, just click the Oregon Tech students, faculty, and staff, and it will automatically log you in. These are our search results. You can see our journal here, Sleep. New York, New York. It's an online journal. It tells you that it's a journal here, so make sure that this icon says journal, not article. And then click on the view it. When you go to view it, this is what that looks like. So I've clicked on the view it tab here. Here, when I want to go to this journal, I will click miscellaneous e-journals. And I want to make sure that I'm looking at the one that's available from 1978, which is Volume 1, Issue 1, the very first. Over here, if I wanted to bookmark this or save the link so that I could access this later, I could go to the permalink. There's other options, such as emailing or printing this particular record, so that I could save it for later. I could also add it to my e-shelf, so anytime I was in the library system, I could view the e-shelf, and there would be access to the journal without having to look it up again. After I click Miscellaneous e-journals, it refers me to this site. This is the same logon, it's just a different system, so please do go ahead and log on again. And here's the journal itself. It automatically shows me the most recent issue, which is Volume 38, Issue 4. In the upper right-hand corner, I have a blue arrow pointing at Quick Search. On the left hand side I have search journal archives. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick search. So I've done a quick search for weight gain and it tells me what I've searched here. If I were to click on search journal archives this is the same screen I would get without the information below it. So here's what I searched. If I wanted to add search words I could do that here. If I wanted to select a certain volume or issue, I could do that as well. When I scroll down, I will be able to see more search results. Right now, it tells me that I have 1 through 10 of 446 results. And again, this goes back to 1978. And I can see the first volume and issue of this article here. Sleep is increased by weight gain and decreased by weight loss in mice. When I click on that article, up at the top, I can see the title of the article, the authors, their affiliations. At the very top, I have an option to share. This gives me things like Facebook, Delicious, Google+. It also gives me an option to email this article to myself. Next to the abstract, which lists the objectives, the design of the research, participants, measurements, and results. Down at the bottom, it also talks about the conclusion, so this is a very good overview of this article. There's a tab that says PDF Print. When I click on the PDF Print tab, it will allow me to download this article, and I will have a full PDF of the article. And on the far right-hand side, it says Table of Contents. If I were to click on that orange arrow next to Table of Contents, it gives me the Table of Contents of this issue. So if it's a special issue, other articles might be on the same theme. You can also get to this journal through the OIT Library's Electronic Resources A to Z list. This is linked off of the library homepage, or you can go to the URL that the arrow is pointing to at the top of the screen. Medline is one of the resources that has this, so I'm going to show you how to get to the sleep journal through Medline, so you can search this way if you prefer. There's a blue arrow pointing at the M, underneath Electronic Resources A to Z. If I were to click on it, it takes me to Medline. If I click on Medline, this is what that looks like. 
I'm going to go ahead and do the same search, weight gain, and down in the right hand side I have an arrow pointing to publication and I've typed in sleep which is the title of the journal that I want to search. And these are what those results look like. Over on the left hand side you can see an arrow pointing to refine results. These are the current results and what it's currently looking at. So it says limiters, publication, sleep, publication, sleep, and it tells me the boolean or the phrase that I typed in, which was weight gain. In the middle of the screen, we have the title of our article, a little bit about that article. If you click on the title, it will give you further information. And underneath that, we have the Find It button at the Find It in Oregon Tech. If I were to click on the Find It at Oregon Tech or the Find It button, it would take me to this screen, which should look very familiar. When we looked up the journal Sleep before, this is similar to what we saw. I would click on Miscellaneous e-journals, and when it takes right back to our journal. There are other places that you can find and search Sleep that the Oregon Tech Library has. These are Article First, CINAHL, Medline, PsycInfo, PubMed. These are all available on that same electronic resources A to Z. And again, if you just search off the library homepage for the journal Sleep, you can go directly to the journal. If you have any questions, please contact us at libtech at oit.edu or 541-885-1773 to get to the Klamath Falls Library or 503-821-1258 to reach the Wilsonville Campus Library and for online students. Thanks for watching.